So before I go into this and shave my head myself, which I feel a little bit nervous about because my hairstylist did it for me beforehand because she knew what she was at. And personally, I'm not a hairdresser, so I have no idea what I'm at. But, you know, I'm pretty sure it could be easy. Hopefully. Maybe. Tim Hortons, large iced coffee, extra cream. Good stuff. What's your favorite one at Tim Hortons if you're Canadian? Or if you live down in the States, what is your favorite coffee place to go to. I just love Tim Hortons. Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. And today's video is going to be me of shaving my head because I feel like, you know what, I want to save money. My hair is after growing back really, really quick, as you could tell, like super, super fast. And I honestly could just see myself constantly always going to my hairstylist, like once a week, maybe two, three times every two weeks, which being a mom and a busy one at that and just being busy in life in general would be kind of hard to do. So if you watched my video on what I got for Christmas, I got a Remington 20 piece hair clipper set. And like I said in the video, it says on it, save time, save money, cut your hair at home. That's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna shave my head. It's either gonna look really, really nice or it's going to look terrible. Oh boy. So now I'm getting a little bit nervous. <laughs> that was kind of a weird laugh, wasn't it? So, I have no idea. I know that you're supposed to put like some type of stuff on it to make it glide easier. I don't know. My hairstylist was spraying stuff on hers. This does not come with any liquid thing. Oh boy. This is going to be an adventure of its own. I should. Mm -hmm. My husband's still upstairs in bed. <laughs> He's going to get a surprise now, isn't he? <laughs> okay, so I managed to get it on a number two. <laughs> We're going to see how this works. Okay. I didn't even take any hair off. I don't know. I can't even tell because I'm not my... Okay, that's not even... What am I doing wrong? Oh yeah, there we go. It is coming off, but... Like, I don't know. I'm trying to look over here to my bathroom mirror because I'm downstairs in the downstairs bathroom. I'm trying to see what I'm doing. I'm making these god awful pieces because I feel like I really can't see what I'm doing. Yeah, okay, so what I've realized is that the two is really not doing anything. Like, I don't know if you guys could tell any difference, but to me, I can't. I think it's gonna be a long, long time trying to do this, so let's see if we can get it here now. feeling in the world. Like literally. I'm telling you Tim Hortons, I love you. I love you, I'm just saying that. <laughs> looks like I'm giving looks like I'm giving myself a mohawk hair. <laughs> yeah, let's see how many hairstyles I could have at once, shall we, in this video? Should be interesting. So I'm just having a moment here right now. I've completely realized how hard it is to actually shave your own head. It is extremely hard. This is super thick and I'm like oh, covered in here. Whew. I hate that feeling when they're all in here. But um, yeah, I've realized how hard this is. So let's just continue on, shall we? And uh, yeah, look at this. This is this is amazing hair to totally, totally feel it right now.
Okay, so, so far, here we go. I really gotta check the back because it is really hard to do the back of your head. I had a hard enough time shaving the top of my head because it was so thick that a number two really wasn't doing it, so then I had to switch it to number one, and it was just uh, having a hard time, so I just constantly had to go over and over again. I have no idea what the back of my hair looks like. <laughs> I, I'm sure it looks really funny because I feel there's places where I really never um, shaved it to properly. So let's take a look at the back of my head, and I'm gonna get a mirror so I can see it myself. Hey guys, the back of my head. Let me see here. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, what the heyday. Oh my god. Oh my god. What what did I do? Okay, I I will I will be back in a minute. See if I can fix that. Whatever the hell I did. Yeah, I highly recommend that if you're shaving your head on your own, definitely have someone to help you because at least then they can see the back of your head. <laughs> so here we go. Here is the final look. I am so happy that this time I shaved it myself. I just wanted to take the power in my hands and just shave my head myself. I went a lot shorter than what my hairstylist did. If you guys didn't see that video when I first shaved my head, I will leave it here on the screen for you guys to check on it. But I really wanted to take that power in my hands and I wanted to do this myself. And to be quite honest, I feel beautiful without hair. I just, I have no attachment to my hair. Hair doesn't define me as a person. I said that in my previous video, that hair does not define you as a person. You know, we're the ones that make the hair. We make the hair look good, you know, and I just feel so beautiful, so confident, really. I feel so much confidence in myself now that I did this to myself, and I wouldn't have it any other way. And you know what? If you guys are thinking about shaving your head, go for it. But definitely have somebody to help you with the back. I did struggle with the back a bit of it. I'm going to turn around and just show you guys because I don't even know. You know, there's a little bit of straggly pieces right here. But I did the best that I can and I'm just, I'm just really happy with it. Might have to go to my hairstylist just to fix it up a little bit. But yeah, so if you guys, like I said, if you're thinking about it, go for it. Do it. We only come around this way once. Let's enjoy it while we can, right? And I just want everybody to know that no matter what, you're all beautiful. If you have long hair or short hair, if you have a shaved head, if you wear your makeup different, if you dress different, no matter what, you are still beautiful. My parents always thought, taught that to me, that it doesn't matter what a person looks like, they are still beautiful they are still that person. Don't treat them any differently if they look different from you. And that is what I've learned from my parents. And I never treated anyone differently. And I never look at anybody differently because I have no right to judge somebody by their looks and nor should anybody else. So my whole purpose of doing videos like this is for my children to look back on it. Like I said that in my previous video when my hairstylist shaved my head. But not only that, for you guys as well. If you guys are like down and out because of the way you look, because if somebody makes a comment, don't be because we're all beautiful. And you know, I want you guys to know that. And I just feel so much more confidence and yeah, I'm going to go rock it even more. <laughs> oh my God, yeah. It's the winter time, so my head might be a little bit cold, but that's okay. I'm gonna go finish my iced coffee. Enjoy that, because that took me forever in a day to shave my head. And I'm also thinking about, should I bleach it? Should I change it a different color? Let me know in the comments down below. And let me know if you guys are thinking about shaving your head let me know in the comments and also let me know what defines beauty to you because to me what defines beauty is everyone and everything and i hope you guys remember that if you're having any doubt about yourself don't because like i said we're all beautiful no matter what so thanks so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time bye